What is up, guys? We've got a video of um, a dirt bike. We're gonna be showing you how to switch out the carburetor. We got a brand new carburetor for it, and it's not it's not that. It's a little bit hard, but not not too too hard. So, uh, so what you need to do? Uh, so this one came with the, the needle and everything for it. So. I don't know if I should take off. Alright, to that. Can't get it in. Okay, so what you need to do first, find the right um size for this. Yeah, that's it. Right size. Man. Two is behind me. There we go. Big truck behind me. So, just get it loose enough until you can undo it with your hand. Make sure the gas is off, okay? So, got this little screw here. Okay, pulled that off. That means one side's undone. We get to the other side and do that one. Shouldn't spill any. Here it comes, Ryan. Yeah. Okay. So, see it over here. It might leak gas depending on if you had it on or not. Um, if you didn't have gas in it before, it will do that. Okay, so, now I want you to see, we have our throttle, this is the throttle cable, it's up here. We can see, okay, ready? Okay, you see that black piece inside of there? See that black piece? Whenever we twist the, uh, here, here. when we twist that cable, it goes up. I don't know if you can tell, but it will go up. That's, so that's, that's what makes the bike, that's what makes the bike go, can you stop? Yeah, that's what makes the bike go, it goes up, it comes up, I'm pretty sure, but yes, the gas is leaking a little bit, so, we'll just take it off, but, what you need to do is unscrew it, okay, so, since we have this one, I might, change everything. I'm not sure though. It might be easier to change everything. But let me grab this. Like that. Okay, so here's the new it's a new one. Put this on here. And you put this this piece put this piece in first if we're gonna change it all. You need to try to get you know what? Is this one bigger than that one? Uh, the same, so they might work. Just wait. Okay, so let me get that piece out. Show you one second. Ah. Yeah, because that's a little bit bad. <laughs> ah. So here's all the old pieces that we had right here. Put them to the side. Grab the new one. This is all you need for the new one. You gotta feed. Feed the line right through it, put it inside the metal, put it in there, and now it should, see when you twist it, it should, whoops, see when you twist it, it goes in, and it comes back out, and then you twist it, that's what the throttle is, so, you need to put this, on, the screw on top of there, and then, 
you need to get that little piece right there. See how it has a hole? Like a hole in it. Sorry, sorry. See that hole in it, like that big line? You need to put the throttle piece inside of there. So it's really tricky. I mean, I've been doing this a couple times already to change it, but for the video, it's going to be a little hard. Because I'm trying to take it while I do it. It's so close. <laughs> I'll pause it till we get it done. Now we got it on. It just went right through there. The needle won't move at all. So when you pull it, watch. You pull it, it goes straight in. See, that's what it goes. Then it'll go. Here's the new one that we got. Exact same, just older. This one's brand new. Um, what you're going to do, there's two knobs inside of there that you'll have to worry about. But it, you just need to make sure you look through the hole to make sure it doesn't get hit or anything so this way pretty sure this is the way it goes maybe not but it's the full way through now so now you're asking me what do I do after I get the full way through I'll show you okay so you just put it the full way through so there's barely any room for anything in there. You can't even put your finger in there. So now you make sure you tw you twist your throttle. See this? That means it's getting it's better with the new one. But now I can put my finger the whole way through if I had it. So it'll go up and it'll just come up like that. All right. So now we got that done. This is the piece for the gas, not the gas. Sorry. This is the piece that goes just hangs out of your bike for any like leftover gas I believe. Not sure why. So, okay, so when you start that, we'll skip forward so you don't have to watch this boring thing, but you have to put both of them in and then it'll just hang there and then I'll show you the rest from there. Okay, we got it on. Finally got it. It was like, like 10 minutes. Okay, so now everything's on. Um, we put the gas in. So I'll show you with the old one. There's this, the one that comes from the can, goes onto, usually looks something like this. It goes right onto there, which is good. So now what we're going to do is we're going to grab this, okay? I'm going to put it right on like this. It's going to go on there, and then we're going to use this to tighten it. But I might not need it to tighten it because I don't know if it'll stuck, so... So, I need to get more comfortable position. Okay, so. Oh man, it's almost there. You can smell it. Even though you can't smell it, I can. But if you do want to see if it works quicker, take this off. Grab some starting fluid okay ours lost tip thing so Wait, how is it not fitting ah one sec it's open okay now it's open spare a little bit of it in you don't want to put too much you might flood it but put it down kick stain up there. 